Step 1. Install Oracle. Check link for video guide in the description. Step 2. Install dBeaver. You can check my last video on how to download and install dBeaver. Let's create Oracle connection in dBeaver by following simple steps. Open dBeaver. Click on the new database connection icon. Select Oracle and click Next. You can connect using basic or TNS connection types. In the basic connection type, you need to provide details like host, port, database name as service or SID and username password. In the TNS connection type, you need to provide a path for TNS file. Let's try basic connection type. You can find all the connection details in the TNS file. I have installed Oracle on my laptop. TNS file is available into this location from C drive in which I have installed Oracle. Open TNS file in notepad. All the required details for connection can be seen here. Copy hostname, port, service name from TNS file to dBeaver Oracle connection window. Enter the schema username and password here. I will use HR schema details. Click on test connection. We need to install Oracle drivers first, this is a one-time process. Click on download. After downloading drivers, dBeaver will try to establish connection again. And it's done, we have successfully connected to Oracle database. Let's quickly try TNS connection type. Locate the TNS file path we used earlier. Select network alias as XE from TNS file. Enter username password and click on test connection. Connected successfully. Click on finish. Let's rename the connection. Check the objects from HR schema. Let's run select query on employee table. We have successfully connected to the Oracle database. Thank you for watching the video. If you like it, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and like Facebook page.